Hi everyone, it's Alicia with the Dockerty Dozen and this is my weekly Costco grocery haul for my family of 14. Here is my list today. I think I can get nearly everything here. I do have this grocery list and my dinner menu and this week's meal plan posted in our community tab. I finally remembered for the first time that Costco is really cold. Um, so I'm like layered up, I'm ready. But first, coffee. All right, let's see if there's any flatbeds. Ah, there is. Woohoo! It's busy! Okay, I'm on the wrong side of the store. Get the coffee. We have a really busy week, so I have super simple meals planned, and one night is just going to be heating up enchiladas. Okay, I just grabbed the whole box out of the freezer of the chicken enchiladas. Alright, I'm out of taco season. Someone needs to invent, like, a clip. You can just clip your shopping list right here. Instead, I'm gonna go like this. Here we go. I need vanilla. Alright, I'm not gonna get the 50 pound bag of flour. We're gonna go with the 10 pound bag. I just like, really don't have the storage for a 50 pound bag. Um, yeah, I'll have to get sugar at Target because I'm not gonna get a 50 pound bag. Get some queso. Okay, we need olive oil and EBOO. Let's we'll try this Kirkland's brand. I've never tried it before. Get some red hat for buffalo chicken wing dip. All right, I'm gonna get canned corn. We ran out of mushrooms. James's 16th birthday is Monday and he wants an oatmeal bar for breakfast. So we need this. With some cereals, good lucky charms, cinnamon toast crunch. chicken stock for a recipe this week. Um, I'm trying a new turkey breast recipe from a slow cooker cookbook I got. Okay, I'm just gonna kind of go into consolidate here. Okay, we are all out of Capri Sun. Um, we still have the Kool-Aid though. I really like have a ton of Kool-Aid. Alright, I'm also gonna get this because Brie likes apple juice. I'm gonna get some more of the Poland Spring Sports Tops. Okay, got two cases of that. Alright, I need forks and spoons. I usually buy these on Amazon, but we're all out, so I'm going to get them here. I laid it up today and they have the heat cranking. But at least it's layers. I can take my coat off. Okay, I'm gonna get little plates. Okay, I 
new garbage bags. We're almost out, so I'm gonna get two boxes. I see the bowls, they're down on the end cap. Okay, let's check our list. I know I'm not gonna be able to get everything here, but I'd like to get as much as possible. Oh, M&Ms, I promised Alex M&Ms. a little heavy so I'm gonna grab a couple more things and then be done with this flatbed and get a cart. I need more laundry detergent. Um, I need dish soap. What do I want? What's this one? bread and be done with this flatbed. I need pretty much everything. I need hot dog buns. I need hamburger buns for chicken patties. I feel like there's no rhyme or reason to what I put on this flatbed. Okay, I'm gonna leave this up front here. Okay, next part. Alright, let's see. What else do we need? I think I'm gonna have to go to Wegmans too. Because. Might have just been a bad batch, but one time we all got food poisoning from chicken from Costco, so now nobody will eat it. So I'm gonna have to go to Wegmans for that. But actually, I don't need that today. So that is not an immediate errand I have to run. All right, let's look at the meats and the produce. Plus, there's some things that I know Wegmans will have. I'm not sure if Costco will have those. That is for around the world night. I'm actually really excited about it because I made the menu for Around the World Night last week. So I've been like looking at these recipes for two weeks now. Um, we're doing Argentina. So yeah, it should be good. Okay, those are pork spare ribs. I need beef. Amazing. Holy cow, they're huge. But there's 12, so like I need two of these because two people would be without a croissant. Yeah, it's not fair. All right, this is chicken. I'm looking for turkey breasts. Turkey, there we go. Oh, that's ground turkey. That's Hmm, I need turkey for us. I did not realize they had like treadmill and stuff here. We have been thinking about turning the sensory gym into a workout room. Okay, I'm just gonna glance at this stuff uh, because these prices are way better than I've been seeing online. Right. Okay, this is like everything now. Oh, I wish Josh was with me. <laughs> Ooh, look at this. Oh my gosh. This dumbbell set. That's so nice. I think this is what Alex wants. And I mean, 
be 99 for a treadmill. It's not bad. The kids kind of stopped using our sensory gym as a sensory gym and use it as like a workout room now and just throw footballs around and stuff. Okay, anyways, I made the executive decision. I'm going to check out at Costco and head over to Wegmans. But I remembered Bree needs more little bites. Okay, I got three boxes of those. Do you want me to put everything up? Top layer up. Okay. okay, that was fast. Now they gotta check the receipt at the door. This is the hardest part walking up the hill to the van. Okay, here we are. I need a car wash. Okay, all that stuff's loaded. Okay, I'm gonna run into Wegmans for the rest of the groceries for this week. Let's go. And we're moving a layer. All right, we gotta do this quick because I've got these enchiladas and eggs. I guess that's it that needs to get in the fridge freezer. I have not been to this Wegmans in forever. So good. 
going to get several of these. Alright, so they are $6.49 a pound. And this is two pounds. Okay, so two pounds. Four and a half. Five, six, seven. Although these look like they have Oh my gosh, I just lost track of how many pounds I had. <laughs> I would say that's like 10. Uh, so, yeah, I'll get to the next one. I'll get another one. Okay. Alrighty. I don't know. Four or five. See, like four is not going to be enough, and five is going to be too much. You know what? We can use the extras for sandwiches. good in wraps. Yeah, I think I'll do that. I can always change the meal plan around. Alright, we're out of Spongebob Golden. wrote brown beef but I actually have some at home um I still have pepperoni okay. oh baguettes okay. which ones do I want uh beef I don't have enough so I'll get there we go this is for around the world night to go with sausage. Okay, I wrote snack packs down. It's like my thing I eat for breakfast. I don't even know what it's called. And I don't see them here. I know Walmart has them and I love a good excuse to go to Walmart. Yeah, I definitely don't see them here. Okay, um, they're kind of like this actually. This is like a different brand, but this is the exact same thing. Okay, I'm gonna get this. Sweet! This is what I've been eating for breakfast lately. It's like the perfect amount because I'm not a huge, I just don't have a huge appetite when I first wake up. But then if I forget to eat, you know, then all of a sudden you're starving at 10.30. Um, there's a train up there in case you're hearing a train. 
in every Wegmans. All right, I'm gonna get some Lunchables. Zoe likes to grab these for snacks sometimes. Well, and so does Jordan and Odie. I did not find M&M's at Costco, so let's look here. There we go. This says family size. <laughs> we need like five of them for my family. chips. What else is fun here? Pretzels. Those are unsalted. That's a no. Mm. Tostitos. bagels at Costco. Bagels. Okay, I'm going to leave that here. Alright, let's get another part. Two. Okay, I'm gonna get the produce. Let's get some grapes. Now, well, let's look at the grapes here. Oh no. Yeah, these look okay. Red grapes and green grapes. Let's look at any of the produce at Costco because then I just decided to ditch out. Oh, I 
oranges. They have blood oranges. Oh my gosh, my kids will be so excited. So good. Alright, we'll get this medium one and this small one. Just put them out. They're still cold. Some blueberries. This looks awesome too. so they don't get smushed. Apples, bananas, celery, carrots, the usual. I'm trying to find like the family bags, the family pack bags. Um, they might not have them here. This isn't one of the bigger Wegmans. Oh, they do. Oh, good. in my other cart, so I'm trying to just remember everything. Bananas look amazing. I might need to come to this Wegmans more often. So like perfection. section
Okay, I need toothpaste. Um, Alright, I told you guys I tried that. I didn't like it. You said Arm and Hammer. Oh, no. There it is. Okay. Is this it? Yes. I think. I think this is what you told me to try. here. Oh no, I gotta get all of those. I totally forgot. What else do I still need to get? Frozen. Okay. All right, I need red wine vinegar for a recipe. Need more applesauce. Need a little bit of salad. Alright, let's look in the European aisle. I mean, I could have made it, but super excited. <laughs> One last thing I have to make. That's awesome. I feel like this Wegmans has more sauces, definitely more sauces than the other one. Two Wegmans I usually go to. I did not get a Costco. This is for a recipe, the turkey recipe. Okay, I'm almost done. I just made. There it is. I'm just looping back around to grab provolone and then those 
herbs that I didn't get. They have so many different kinds of cheese. I just want provolone. Hmm. I walked right past it. Okay, here's the Costco receipt. And my goodness. So I feel like even with going to Costco first, I don't really feel like I saved money. I did get crab legs though. I don't know. I just keep trying to see the theory if I would save money doing some of my shopping at Costco. I don't know. I don't know yet. Okay, I still gotta put this stuff away, but like a lot of the freezer fridge stuff's put away, so that's good. One day at a time. Thank you for coming shopping with me today. You are strong, you are beautiful, you are loved, you belong, and I am so proud of you. I'll see you next time.